right, so we are at 112, unit 112, 100 Pinewood. I want you look at the uh, description there so you'd be able to pause it if you would like. So we have a few stairs coming up. Um, we've got a storage area to the left and a storage area to the right, and they are identical inside as far as shape is concerned. So um, about four feet by three feet, get a little bit of angle there uh, on the wall. But uh, so that's the first one, and again, the second one is pretty much identical. This one has has that power though, so that's that's a nice feature if you wanted to hook up something up here. You got your exterior light. Nice storm door as well. Probably a Pella. Anderson, even better. Um, you have a scalloped uh, front door here. Coming in, nice Mediterranean tile, uh, 14 inches, so good size, which is appropriate for this size uh, of, a, of a space there. You have your air handler and you have some storage here um, for your coats. Again, you have uh, some nice granite, black with a little bit of brown mixed in. Your cabinets are in good shape, really. They, um, yeah, they look like they're in really, really nice shape. Uh, you have Frigidaire stainless steel appliances, the dishwasher here. Um, nice uh, deep sink. For sure, undermount sink uh, with the backsplash, adding some lights underneath here. Some under undermount lights would give you some more light there for task lighting uh, range. Looks in, you know, decent condition, definitely needs a cleaning. Uh, you have a wine fridge here. All right, so that's kind of cool. Um, and your frigid air. Refrigerator with some uh, items still inside. So then in the kitchen, you also have your washer dryer hookups. And above that, you have plenty of storage there. So looking out, you have a very funky uh, dining room light. You may want to go with something a little less uh, bulbous or massive, but you have some a good space here for a table and, and some other things for sure. It's a good size space, uh, looking about 14 feet uh, on that wall. And then, so we have probably close to 18 feet. And you can kind of get a sense right here of the texture of the walls. They're, um, it's, it's hard to see because there's not a whole lot of, a lot of light here, but they, uh, it's like a swirl pattern. With, with like a little bit of a um, Mediterranean motif as well um, with that. You have a fan here, it's not lighted, so I think getting some, maybe some recessed lighting up, up there would be great. Uh, and maybe a fan that has a light on it. The entertainment center went there. So you have six, 12, about 14 feet to this back wall here. So obviously the, the couch could, it could go right about here with your TV and you have some, some space over here uh, for maybe a, a sectional couch. And you have this nook over here for a uh, chair. Uh, let's go ahead and out, go outside since we are here. So this is one of the best features, I believe. You have a grandfathered in uh, hot tub. So, um, this is a rarity. I don't think there's any other around here, so that's that's it can be good or bad. Um, we've done a little bit of repairs on some decking boards, uh, but yeah, the deck is is huge. It's it's massive. Uh, you've got a speaker over here that may or may not be still connected. I'm not sure. Um, but yes, that's the size. The deck. 
and the boat slip is right between those two boats that is needed for this property. And that every only about half of the units here have a beaded boat slip. And you have one, two, three, four, five, six stairs to get down to this grassy patch that goes uh, around to the front or side of the unit, depending on how you look at it. So good, great place to walk walk a pup or two. So going back in. So this is, a, this is a little bit sunken in with two stairs, and you're gonna see that there's two stairs reflected in the master, which we'll hit in a second. So this is a little bit of a darker room. It's been it's really dreary out today. Um, so maybe some some uh, uh, lights on in the ceiling would be great here. Some recessed lighting, perhaps, or maybe a fan with the light on it. And then you have your um, hot water heater and a screen for one of the um, one of the sliders in the master, and then we have a little linen closet here, and then we have a little bit of accent tile, which is nice, leading into the tiled um, main bathroom for guests or for the the, the previous bedroom. Uh, again, that accent tile is embedded in the shower, which is nice. It's got a jacuzzi. Um, portion to it, which you don't see very often at all. Um, we have a heat light, if it's a little chilly, and the vanity is in, looks to be in good condition. That's a problem. Um, <laughs> we wanna maybe cut that, uh, cut that down some, perhaps, or um, didn't notice that before. Um, but otherwise, it's in, it's in good shape. And then finally, we'll go into the master. Again, there's the two steps here. So, good size master. We got about 16, 18 feet against this wall right here, which is a, what I would presume where the bed went. And so, this is your view. It's pretty nice. You have a roundabout here. Um, so, cars really can't go but so fast around a roundabout. So, it keeps the traffic noise down. Uh, really well. Uh, you also have a, in this room we do have a ceiling fan with a light on there, which I will turn on now. Um, and that's where the TV would go. So, and then, so let me catch some lights here. Okay, so this is a little, little alcove here. Um, it's about two and a half feet deep. Might be good for a little table. Um, or you could add some more closet uh, you know, a little cabinetry in there if you want to. I believe you can hook this, hook the light up um, back and get some more light in there. And um, here is the walk-in closet. So we have some, a little bit of, not really built-ins, but uh, some furniture pieces in here for storage. Some storage behind the, behind the, uh, the door and Okay, and there's the remote control for the fan. Some more closets, closet uh, material. So we walk in here, we try and catch the lights. Okay, so we walk in, good size vanity with um, nice light, fi light fixtures, a little bit of nautical theme right there. Yeah, so the cabinets appear to be in good condition. Roll out all the way. Nice, nice faucet here. Toilets to be in good condition. We have a really nice uh, shower that will pummel you with water if you want it. So uh, with the adjustable right here. So definitely, uh, definitely good for people a little bit taller and a little bit shorter. And you have a teak bench um, to sit down. So again, really, really, really nice uh, glass shower right here, for sure. And uh, I'll go right out here. And uh, I may have forgotten the, 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 pan the little pantry area here. So, and that will, that will conclude this video tour.